Hello, I'm Ashley and welcome to XCOM 2. Last mission, we lost some incredibly important troops. We're down to six available, which is useful because we need six people to go on this really important mission. There is a UFO that's down. It's landed, and we could really use the supplies, so let's launch the mission. I don't have a choice about who we're taking. We only have six people to take. Three snipers! <laughs> Two specialists and a grenadier. Honestly, close quarters of the inside of a UFO. I really don't want to be taking snipers, but I've got no choice. I'll show you. If we remove... Nope. None available. Can I, like, change your main weapon? I can't even give him a rifle. That's really frustrating. Okay, uh, we have a Skulljack that we could add. Um... You're our best, uh, most valuable troop around Tharu, other than uh, Shady, so I think we'll give you the nanoscale vest. Do we upgrade to grenades? No. You need just all grenades. In fact, Amwick. How would you like to be the one to trial our new combat armor, the exosuit? The EXO armor suit gives our soldiers the power they need to handle heavy weapons with the durability to match. Wrist mounted rocket launcher. That's what I like to see. Launcher. Oh, I don't have any more there. Okay. Um. We're gonna have to start giving people. Oh yeah, you lose a slot by doing that. With the excess suit. It's fine. Um. I'm gonna give you the backup weapons. So mimic. Smoke. Gonna be a horrible, horrible way to take the enemy, but we're gonna have to do it this way. Um, right. Couple of last minute changes. Your weapon looks horrible. Also, we can upgrade your weapon. How many upgrades do we have? Like tons? We have to spend some of these. Yeah, we're gonna have to upgrade some of those. Uh, weapon color. There we go. Suits you. Right. Uh, I'm trying to think who gets weapon upgrades. Ramatharu, let's just double check your weapon, actually. You have got a scope. We could give you an advanced scope. We've only got a scope at the moment. But that would remove the one we've already got. This is a bit wasteful. Okay. Um, in which case, Corporal Shadow. You get an advanced scope. Weapon upgrades. What would you want to put on this? Crit? Nah. Hair trigger. 5% chance that the shot will not cost an action. Expanding, mag expanding magazine. Expanding 
Okay, Sith Threather. Hair Trigger. Stock, Miss Shot still do damage. Crit, no. One of these two. Miss Shot still do damage. It's pretty useful for like taking out codexes at one health or whatever. Yeah, Miss Shot still do damage. And... Anwick. Hair trigger. 5% chance it will not cost an action. If you're having a smiley face weapon... There we go. Suits you. Let's do it! I'm so dubious about how this is going to go. But let's do it. Deployed. Squad green to deploy. I really don't want to do this. Okay, landed UFO. It took some work, but apparently the resistance managed to disable a UFO that set down in this area. Unfortunately for them, alien reinforcements moved in before they had a chance to pull anything off the ship. We're heading in to take whatever we can. Secure the site and eliminate all hostile contacts. Menace one five UFO site coordinates locked in. Move to secure the area. Neutralize all hostiles. The squad's concealed. At least we have concealment. Right, that's a start. So I think I'll go to here because it's high cover and then we can advance. I don't know what's up here. Moving. What might be good is getting our snipers up here. I can walk up there anyway. Oh, oh wait, shoot. Good to go. On the move. Yeah, let's just get all of our snipers in position. Headed there now. Effectively, we're going to be running a very Leaving interesting mission. Heading out. Turret. Okay. Well, we can hack it. Orders confirmed. Although my move. record of hacking isn't great. Affirmative covering now. Watch. Roger. I've got my eyes on. Good copy, moving on target. Ramatharu. Affirmative, moving out. Understood, moving out. Well, a shadow. Affirmative, moving out. I'm looking for a very good opening turn here. On the move. I assume this is going to be one of those missions where everything is move. ridiculously tough because, you know, enemy UFO. It's kind of the home ground. Flying Roger, home I've ground. Got my eyes on but the point stands. Roger. I've got my I'm eyes on it. On. I'm on it. Good. Hit enemies off to the left there. Move into position. There we go. Have a turret. A lot of armor, that one. Yeah, they've got both got a lot of armor. That's affirmative. Orders confirmed. Okay, I'm probably looking to activate relatively soon. And what I want is a very good opening. Long watch, long watch, Overwatch. You don't have long watch, so I want to bring you much closer. Copy that. Grapple out! I'm gonna get Ramathara on the other side, so I've got a bit of a uh, variety. Time to motor. I'm on the move. Overwatch. 
Alright, Gary Fox is in. They're not moving. I really want them to move. Roger that. Roger that. Heading to that location. Okay, everyone. On Overwatch. Affirmative. Covering now. Scanning. Roger. Right. I've got my eyes on. Scanning. Eyes on the prize. Come at me, bro. I can hear movement. Yeah, they are moving. Right, I think what we'll do is we'll wait for them to come back a little bit. Heading there now. And then we'll try and get them to trigger on us. Because, you know, as I've said many times, it's better for the enemy to trigger on you. Heading out. Do I go to here and get a good shot on that? Yeah, I think I do. Moving to designated coordinates. I'm on it. Overwatch. Scanning. Eyes on the prize. Moving to Overwatch. Got it covered. They come at me. Oh, mutant. Okay. I thought it was just part of sectoids. This makes it a little bit more dangerous. Alright, I'm gonna go stand in the open so that they can see me and we can get shots. Moving. Which is different from getting shots at the bar, which is a lot more fun and less likely to result in your death. Moving to Overwatch. I'm on it. On Overwatch. Got it covered. On Overwatch. Affirmative. Covering now. I mean, this UFO is properly disabled. Like, they've got, like, barricades and stuff set up and everything. Like, you know, this, this UFO wasn't quickly uh, disabled and the aliens expect to have it back up. This UFO is, like, properly downed. Headed there now. Oh, they've got a glass in that window I hadn't noticed. Okay. I'm going to move out of here because uh, I just realized that if we activate on their turn and I'm trying to shoot the turret, turret won't move. Turret won't, like, give me something to activate on. This needs to be a good Overwatch turn. I need to at least get, like, Overwatch. probably two guys. I don't like that over those turrets. I don't mind me flying at the moment. Because that way they'll trigger if they come past. Might be a couple of turns before they come back round. There we go, actually, they're coming back round now. Right, so how are we going to get seen? Kind of thinking Anwick. Heading there now. at me, guys. You want to take this on? Bring it. So close. Okay. They're going to activate next turn. I won't have any real good high cover to dive into. Unless they free their cover up, but... No. no let's just set it up. I'm on the move. This is where we activate. Roger, I've got my eyes on. I need to make it good. Overwatch. Roger, I've got my eyes on. I'm on it. Eyes on the prize. Overwatch. Hi. Wait, you didn't spot me?
really? Good copy. Moving on target. On Overwatch. Affirmative. Covering now. Affirmative. I wish we had a Let's button go. for all over. I'm on it. Come along, while bring that back. So I'm just going to be overwatching until they activate. Got it covered. Moving to Overwatch. Scanning. They're just standing there. They are. Eyes on the prize. On Overwatch. Eyes on the prize. Overwatch. Overwatch. Moving to Overwatch. On Overwatch. Affirmative covering nine. There we go. Come at me. Come at me. Roger. I've got my eyes on. Roger. I've got my eyes got on. Got it Eyes on the prize. All right. They just stop moving. No, they should continue doing their patrol. Come on. I'm the way I'm set out, I'm too close to Scanning. actually in my turn because then they'll just rush me and I'll die. What if I throw a mirror beacon? Will it just activate them? Well, here we go. They found us. Shocking. Nice. Nice. Missed, but still one damage because, uh, cool mod. Good. Missed. It's still moving. Ramatharu. Yes! Hit the armor. Kill confirmed. I'm actually afraid of these turrets. They're pretty tough. We just picked up an outbound signal coming from the UFO. It's some kind of distress beacon. Oh, you're kidding. We need to get inside that ship and shut down the signal before they send their whole fleet after us. I wasn't prepared for a rush job. Right. What I'm going to try and do is hack the first back turret. Hey, our protocol. Go. I'll try to control it. Will it be good enough just to temporarily stun the turret? I think it might be. Uh, it would have been good enough to get control, but whatever. Right, turret stunned. I'm in. Two turns. Right, your job is this turret here. Make it good. around Tharu. Only aliens? Okay. In which case, um, go for that one. What about that? Good. Sure, I could use a ranger right about now, though. Hit the armor. What I'm going to do is I'm going to grenade, get you exposed. How much firepower do I have left? Effectively, just you two, in which case I probably can't kill that turret this turn. Getting no in which 
which case I have to make uh, on my way. Ex not an exception. What's the word? I have to make uh, allowances Grenade for that. There out. we go. That's the word. Right. This needs to be a hit. Yeah. Crit will do. Crit will do. Hostile neutralized. Um, I don't think I can really get much closer. No. I will start to move the Ramatharu up then. Death from above is really useful, but... I can only see, like, one person here anyway. Okay, I need to kill both heavy turrets this turn. And an overwatch. Great. Well, this is your time to shine. Nice. Target down. Okay, we'll start blasting this as we go. Right, um Affirmative, moving out. Should have taken a shot from this time position, but oh well. That's even go to the armor. Oh no, one point of damage. Well that's because yeah, if, if we miss, we get oh, that counts for that. Nah, no, probably not. Um I think we need the help. Make it a dead eye. There we go. Not too shabby. Which means... I don't know if this door still opens. It used to. We can move up. I'm all over it. Got it covered. I really don't want the enemies to have reinforcements. That would be bad. That said, I don't know what to be expecting inside. Moving! The power supply on this ship is likely to be a newer variation of the Illyrium core driving the Avengers systems. Advent forces sighted! Could I just blow it up? Probably a little bit wasteful. Okay. Don't think I want to be there. I'm on the move. Sure thing. I'm moving to the open because they probably can't see me back here. And I'm going to reload. That way I can get shots next turn. Um, you're going to have to just sprint to get closer. Step it off. Moving. You need to get the hell out of there, but I don't think you can. Maybe it'd be better if you... Great, can't see inside the UFO. Good copy, moving on target. Could give a defense buff. Yeah, let's do that. I still got a hit. I might have winged them. Ow. Oh. 
Aha! That dodge bonus uh, really helped. All right, next guy. One thing I'll do is I'll go in. I won't even pull back. I'll go in. And I'll just mute the front. Okay, this is bad. You're not stunned. It's fine. All right. Hi, guys. I'm afraid that your uh, victory will be short-lived. Okay. Have you heard about your good... Uh, Lord and Savior, gigantic ass grenade. Fire in the hole. It's a niche. It's a niche god. Rocket launcher. Ah, okay, right. Moving on target location. This one's for you. Nice. I love that. We need more of those exosuits. Who has a shot? You have a shot. Take it. Ah, you were shot. I could get the high cover and take it, or I could just run right up and be like, yes, yeah, screw it, we need to, you to die, so. Absolutely. Space Katomi! Hi. Right. What? I only scratched them. Running dry. We need to get close enough to use pistols then. Whatever you say. No need to ask twice. This could be fatal. No problem, boss. Well, they got lucky last time, so it's our turn to be lucky this time. Frankly. Right. I can't hack it this turn. We're really going to be cutting this to, down to the wire. And Space Katobi can hack it, actually. Or we could get a Skull Mine. Or if we Skull Mine and we fail... Yeah, no, Space Katobi, I want you to hack. The reason you can do that is Gremlin. On my way. Oh, you can't. It doesn't work like that. Fine. We could try Skull Mining. Goes wrong. Moving out. Right, who's a shot? Five. That's the distress beacon. Move in and disable it before the aliens get a bead on the UFO. I can't take the risk. I can't take the risk of going in and trying to escape mine. Down. Weapons burning ammo fast. I'm going. Moving. Back in. Rolling out. All right, move up. Heading to that location. I wouldn't mind getting a closer look at their flight computer. Ours could probably use some updates. Affirmative, covering now. Get your heel on. Go medical. Oh, really? Our resistance contacts had heard rumors Advent might be rolling out a heavy infantry armor system. Looks pretty tough. Here's the thing. If we don't press that, we're screwed. We need to press the button. It's 
gonna leave you in a horrible place, John, but... Attempting connections. Oh, we nearly made it to 3% mark. Beacon's deactivated. Got it. We've knocked out the alien distress signal. Oh, you can still move. Looks like the skies are quiet. Sweet. Very tempting just to nade that or something. Let's see how much firepower I can bring to the front, because I don't think I can bring all that much. On the move. If I move anywhere here, he's going to come around here and flank. If I move to here, they're going to move to there and flank. Where can I get you? Half cover? Full cover, but flankable. Half cover. Rolling! And I need the snipers here, like now. Running. You're no good to me if you haven't reloaded. Double time. Confirmed. Aha! No, we have a mimic beacon. How far can we throw it? Right. Aid protocol. On Jordan Minor. Get the bonus defense. Now. Space Katomi. Heading out. Overwatch. Watch. Yeah, as I thought. Oh, I just like that. Are you going to stab? Yes. I Apparently the animation didn't play. Stunned. Down to two health. Okay. Got no shot. I don't want to damage too much of the stuff in here, which is really annoying. I mean, Beacon didn't really do anything because they didn't flank us. I thought they'd flank us this way. If I use a grenade... Oh, I don't want to blow the Illyrium cores. That's the problem. I'm trying to do as minimal damage as possible. Skull mine would kill this guy. Do it. It's risky. Oh, Overwatch! Ow! which means I need to waste someone else. Alright, what have we got? Anwick. But you can't move in behind there. Can't shoot you because I have no shots left. I can heal or I can reload. Ramatharu could move forwards. I honestly think that, that's probably not going to be the case. That. Can't get any good sniper shots. There we go. You see that one? Well, let's try to move up, flank with that pistol, and you've got a grenade, so, you know, you have, you have options. 
You have the ability to put down a force field and stuff. You've already got a force field up. Um, you are behind the Illyrium core, so I can't use explosives on you, but that doesn't stop me from using explosives on someone else. Hi. I don't know what that is. Possible that if I destroy it, bad things would happen. So I'm just going to launch it Catch. here. Enjoy. You didn't destroy cover. Damn it. You've got rid of your shield, which just means you're going to re-shield. <sighs> right, move up to there. That way you're doing good flank. Um, it's going to be risky moving to here. But you can overwatch. I think you just start need to heal people. Um, Jordan Minor. If we get grenaded, Jordan Minor will go down. This is messy inside of his snipers. I, mean, I could lure them out, but I kind of got trapped here. Okay, I thought that would happen. If he bomb rushes us, we can do what we can do, but... That armor's tough. Unconscious. Unconscious. Still alive, however. Sith Threva, you're still alive. No, don't panic. I need you. Oh, it's a flank shot. Really? Really? Okay, okay, okay. We have this. Shoot him with the pistol. It hit the plate. Yeah, it still was a crit though. Don't worry, it was a crit. Um, Ramathari can get a shot. Amwick can get a shot. Can Amwick get into cover to do the shot? Probably not. Oh, doesn't have a shot. Out of ammo. Out of ammo. Really? Okay, this might be messy. Whatever you say. Right, do we have grenade? Target. Minimal damage. No. No. No oh, right. Well he's gonna live for another turn, which means he's gonna attack someone else, which means probably another death. Doesn't matter how I position okay. things compared to him, because he's always going to be able to flank someone. Ready to engage. Ready to engage. Oh, and you can shoot in a turn and reload. Doesn't make much of a difference. Okay, so reloading doesn't end your turn anymore. I know it's taken me ages to realize this, but it's a big change. You're probably dead. Oh, yes! Yes, what a dodge! Okay, what about you? Oh, no, 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 no! Oh! She's honestly my highest ranked troop right now. Maybe join, I don't know. But we, we need her. We need her. Okay, now, question of who we're giving the kills to. Amwick, I would like you to get a kill. Moving to position. Nice. No longer a threat. Ground Saru, no, you're already leveled. Warlord, uh, no, I honestly, I think snipers aren't quite as good as, you know, they used to be. Um, Jordan Miner, yeah, you could do with upgrading. Headed there now. Confirmed. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Oh. 
All enemies killed. No reinforcements came in. Four soldiers wounded, none dead. Excellent. And we've got a UFO. Successful shops at 100%. It's just lying to me at this stage. That was tough. That was tough. We did it, though. Makes up a little bit for last mission. Not quite. David will be missed. Rangers are amazing. Seriously, I... Squad of all rangers, honestly, might be a bit OP. We need more rangers. I think... I think I'm the only ranger now. Oh, dear. We need to get more recruits. We might have to buy someone. Or we could retrain them. We could retrain them using the advanced warfare center. Not that we have enough people to really spend time retraining. So many gravely wounded. Face off. Fire once every visible enemy with your pistol. That's pretty cool. You just run into a room and be like, right, bang, bang, bang. Kill zone. Take a reaction shot against any enemy that moves or attacks within a cone of fire. Nice. Yeah, I'll take that. Did I? Ah, uh, long watch. Medical protocol. Let me just check. Yeah, medical protocol. And then shredder. Just, you know, stand there. Don't help anyone up. We got an advanced scope, a superior autoloader. The first three lives in mission do not cost an action. That's really nice. Mutant corpse, sectoid corp. God. Um, turret wreck, stun corpse, officer corpse, shield bearer corpse. A load of alloy, a load of crystal, alium core, and supplies. Really good haul there. Integrate these improvements into some of our own armor designs. Maybe be able to integrate the technology to improve chance of defending against UFO attacks. That would be good as well. On manpower, Commander. We should check with Resistance HQ for new recruits. Reduced will. Shaken. John Minor shaken. Amwick is shaken. Well, we need to do some hiring. Um, I could recruit base level people, or I could skip that entirely, and we could go and have a look at who's available at the uh, Resistance HQ. Destroy convoy supplies. Uh, not now. Resistance Setting HQ, what you got for, for me? South African sector. Welcome, Commander. Oh, I can't afford them? Eh, it's just a grenadier anyway. How bad is our medical situation? Oh, many days. Many, many, many days. I won't be able to even, like, set up a good force for at least nine. And that's four people. That's not a good force. Oh, sorry. Eight. Nine, we can get to five. We're going to have to put someone into the medical bay to speed up healing. Um, who do we take off duty? Honestly, if we take you off duty... Ah, uh, that would then unstaff that. I'm sorry, we're gonna have to stop the excavation temporarily. And I might retrain... Warlord Shadow. Oh, it doesn't... It only retrains your abilities. It doesn't train your class again? Ah. Oh. That's nah, wasteful. Um, I need rangers. I really need rangers. What's our healing situation like now? Yeah, we're looking at about... One, four, five, seven, nine. So in five days, we could have a reasonable squad. Seven, we could have a good squad. And by good, I mean just enough people. I don't mean a good composition. Oh, wrong one. Actually, no, maybe not the wrong one. Maybe we should be having a look at what we could spend, because I, I think we've got enough 
stuff that we could actually uh, buy some stuff now. Like we've got alloys and lyrum cores and stuff. It's a lot of stuff, I know. Um, and these, these are cheap, right? They, they cost alloy and crystal and all that jazz, but they're fairly cheap. I would like another exosuit actually, because they're really useful. Um, but this is going to take time, and we don't really have time. It's already building a load of stuff in the Just queue. Just give the word, and I'll get started, Commander. What do we have over here? Weapons, advanced grenade launcher. Yes. Yeah. Advanced grenade launcher. Is. Tygen seems to have a habit of scratching that scar on the back of his head. Oh. Don't judge him. This gives us the gorilla op to do. It takes seven days. I don't really want to do any more missions right now. I'm going to continue making contact with India. Setting course for Sector 5, India. We need to get some uh, ranges. The outcome of this research can only further our advances, Commander. Advent has legions of these Criminal mechanized two. units out there helping to keep the peace. As far as I can tell, they're fully automated and armed to the teeth. Uh, the facade only works because carefully designed weapon systems integrated into the machine. Because they used the peacekeeping operations. I don't think people would react so calmly if they knew about the micro-missile launching system linked to the Advents network running facial recognition in the crowns for micro in, in, in microsecond intervals. Okay. We get Grand Mark II and a blue screen protocol. Um, blue screen protocol is a proving ground project. Grand Mark II is an instant. Uh, Grant increased the hacking stat of our specialists, but many specialist abilities improve their effectiveness when the Grand becomes more advanced. Okay. Blue screen protocol. Uh, munitions capable of disabling them should be our highest priority. Tigans just look into their corporate system, and I agree it's a good place to start. Two, two days to the turret breakdown. Three days to the... Yeah, we'll do the, right the turrets we see employed by Advent throughout their various facilities and security checkpoints are automated, much in the same way the alien mechanized units are. A significant amount of time was likely spent developing the optical sensors and targeting system, which I expect Shin will want to thoroughly examine following the disassembly process. I like the fact you're doing that on the operating table. Surely there's better places, but... Okay, you know. I was not going to admit it to Shin, but there is one thing I miss more than my lab equipment. Those damn juicy Advent burgers. I don't know where they get the meat, and frankly, I do not want to know. Um... I think you're a cannibal, mate. I have made a number of interesting discoveries, Commander. Advent doesn't seem to have any issues stationing completely autonomous weapons in close proximity to the people in those cities. Really shows you how much they care. Um... I say the certainty that turrets are operating entirely on their own with no outside control or remote direction given. As much as they'd like to test the targeting system, Central and Dr. Kaiden both uh, expressed concerns about test firing system before we now have to discern between friendly and hostile targets. Considering how close the alien's position with these things to civilian really occupied areas, the target resolution software must be incredibly accurate, at least basic. I wouldn't be at least surprised if the, if the aliens were flipping the switches and then setting them loose on anyone caught in the firing radius. I'll have to see about setting up some sort of a test environment. New facility available. Defense matrix. Repurposes Advent turrets as automated defenses to be deployed in the case of a grand assault on the Avenger. Oh. That's kind of cool. Um, Sionics would allow us to, like, build a Scilab or something. It's, we don't have, like, we don't have the room to build a Scilab right now. So, shield bearer. Physically, Baron. the Advent shield bearers are quite similar to the bulk of Advent's forces and that they are the product of careful genetic engineering that generally mirrors the human form. Most of their unique qualities come from a difference in equipment and armor. Components I'm sure Shen would have an interest in examining. Okay. Oh, don't give me a mission, don't say anything, please. 
We need to move on the adventure part of the Avatar project. The aliens yeah. continue to make progress on the Avatar project. If we're going to slow them down, we'll need to move fast. Yeah. It, when they get another block, I think we have to start acting. Hello. 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 We're reading you. New regional contacts located. Right. We'll put a transmitter down here. And I think we'll also then hit up the black market because you can buy stuff there, including recruits, I think. Supplies, that'll be good, but it's going to take too long. Install? Oh, it cost me supplies to do that. <sighs> Damn. Okay. Uh, we'll hit the black market. Avenger plotting new course. Priority message coming oh, no. through, Commander. Putting it on screen. Oh, now. it's it's Leading the end of month. The resistance is a daunting task, Commander. But your efforts so far have left many wondering if we have made the right approach. We will have to do better. Wait, we'll have to do better? I did every <sighs> We've got a lieutenant we can hire, which is great. One week until they do one of these. What's the hidden event? Should I reveal it? Honestly, I'm not going to. Two weeks. Till around, till Asian strike. New uh, facility in one week. Preparing, preparing. Done about this one. Two weeks. Okay. I'm gonna do the black market, then I'll hit the supplies These up. These findings will likely prove crucial to our ongoing efforts, Commander. These shield bearers are not all that dissimilar from their various advent peers. Their armor is perhaps the most distinctive feature differentiating them. Experimental armor. I have to check what that's about. Okay. Um... Dedicate my team's resources to crypt the file and ensuring that we cover the large amount of intel stored within. Yeah, sure. Three days more intel. I assumed you'd make that research a priority, Commander. I'll notify you as soon as the report is available. Commander, if we want to set back the aliens' work on the Avatar oh. project. We should hit one of their facilities as soon as possible. Okay, we're going to be hitting the facility very soon, but I need a ranger. Shredder gun. Risk mounted slug thrust for a cone of razor shot projectiles damaging multiple enemies and shredding their armor. Oh. What mission? Rescue VOP from Advent Cell. We get an engineer and 92 intel. Can we do the mission? Course for South Africa. I probably should have checked in the armory or whatever. Let's see. Come on. Please tell me we can do the mission. Yeah, we have a full squad. We have a full squad. A few too many snipers. Can I remove one of the snipers? No. Right. Okay. Many snipers. Many, many snipers. Okay. But that's going to be next episode. Next episode, we're going to hopefully get ourselves an engineer and 92 Intel. I've been there listening. If you like, please like, not subscribe. Please consider subscribing. It's getting awfully dangerous on that uh, that advent track. Hopefully, we'll survive. But I'm a bit dubious. We're starting to push it. We need, we need a ranger. Straight up. We need another ranger. It's dark, it's dank, and it's mostly metal. This ship isn't all that different from the old base. That's true. I mean, you know, admittedly, it flies and can fall out of the sky. It wasn't really a problem in the old base, I'll be honest. That was something I didn't have to worry about. But, uh, yeah. Until next time, if you enjoyed, you know what to do. And stay shiny.